Uh, good evening. Thank you so much for being here. We're going to talk to you event. We'd like to thank you for joining us on a Thursday night in Spaceland. It started out with me and Mikkel uh, in a room, summer 2006, playing, sweating, jumping, laughing, crying, stomping, shouting. Uh, a lot until, of sweat. Anything else? Uh, <laughs> a lot of beer. Do, a lot of sweat. I don't think you could do anything else. I know. I think you just, you just described the range of human action. Yeah. <laughs> we put together the uh, the foundation of the songs. Who came next? I think it was Steven. Uh, I think Anna was actually the next official person. We had friends in common, and I, we were out at El Gran Burrito in the corner of Vermont, so I'm on at like two in the morning. Two in the, yeah, it's two in the morning. Yeah, and I was like, oh yeah, don't you play like violin or some shit? I asked her if she would play um, on a few songs, and then as it turns out, she could also play a lot of other stuff. <laughs> So then Steven and I have known each other, and actually Steven was a writer, I didn't even know he like could play um, well, instruments at all. He was and it turns out it's still a little, I'm still not sure. <laughs> you were looking for a bassist, that was the first time I heard of your band, and you asked me if we knew a bassist. So wait, was, was Noah the last to come in there? Noah was the last, I actually asked Noah, Noah and he said no, <laughs> the first time I asked him. Well I think we had the show before. The first time, <laughs> the, no, the first time yeah. we played, we like, an echo we show played with another, another guy. It's literally days away, yeah, yeah. and then you know Noah's gonna come, he's gonna come, are you sure? <laughs> I don't know what it looks like. We weren't even together for the first time until like five days before yeah, the first yeah. show at the Echo. Thank you all again. We'll see you next week. It's so great to have you all here. Thank you so much for coming out. I think that's the thing about the residency is that um, you come here like three, four, or five times, and by the end, it's like you're, it's like it kind of feels like a, a home. It's family. It's, yeah, it's been warm. It's been nice. It's like a, it's like a, a big warm hug from Silver Lake. Yeah, it's true. We yeah. got warm mug of cocoa. It was really expensive for us to get all those people there. So. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to give out a little advice for about tonight. Um, 
If you've already bought a ticket, which I think we've already sold out of all the tickets online. I think there's only tickets available at the door. And if you don't get there early, you will not get in. Uh, I saw them open for I'm a Robot a little while ago at the Roxy, and it blew my mind. And we actually came a couple of weeks ago to see them, but three of our people in our group weren't of age to come in. So I spoke to them, told them I couldn't stay, etc. They tried to get me to buy them fake IDs, but we had to end up going home. This is my third time going to the residency. Man, they're, they're worth the hype. This is unheard of, this many people being here tonight. He's all like coming out from the OC. Yeah, yeah, every oh, yeah. single friend I have on MySpace. He's, he's on the like page. web page. He's every on the day. MySpace like every day. <laughs> even even my my tia Chancha knows about it. <laughs> it's true. <laughs> it's special. true. Special. She oh, loves him. Who's the pura madre? She walks out. I just feel like shows are about trying to connect with people and like really like you know people walk out feel like they know us and we know them. It's usually a trying to like remove any line between us on the stage and them in the audience. So it's all just like one thing. It just seems that they're really human and that's different for something of this level and of that caliber. It's really wonderful to come see them because you can tell that each one of them is completely invested in what they do. And that's different and very welcome. that we just like kind of went out there and and played what we thought sounded good and people came and more people came. We really, really like appreciate like having people at shows. Like it's so like like I feel like I'm a big fan of our like audience. Like it's such a great thing to be able to play and I, you know it just feels like it's the best thing in the world. We, we've only been a band for a year. We just finished uh, recording our, our full length record that we just did ourselves uh, with our friend Pete. And we're at this point now, we don't, it's just us. Like, you know, all this stuff, you know, it all happened really quickly. And we have no idea, you know, we just keep track of the things that we can control and we're just trying to do those.